Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we are reacting to Primal Rights brand new debut, I would say, EP called the Star Mage EP that was released on Silkenwood. Um, as of day of recording this, it's the 8th. It released today and I gave it a listen on stream today. Uh, if you want to see me react to some things live, make sure to click the subscribe button down below. Primal Rights took the inspiration spot for me once Jotes and Jarell Morel uh, kind of left the scene. Uh, so Primal Rights really filled in that gap for me and unfortunately with the release of this EP he has decided to retire from making uh, React content and the best thing that I could do to honor this was to react to his new EP That's what I'm doing this video for Primal Rights if you're watching this Thank you so much for um, an inspiration and for being an awesome guy this work of art as you'll see is unbelievable to me and to a bunch of other people so thank you for your influence and without further ado here is primal rights brand new ep called star mage let's do this star mage ep by primal rights stargate first song so i guess now's a good time to say that primal rights uh is was a massive influence for me in doing deck music uh at least music reaction content just because i want to i love it and I'm a content creator at heart, so that's what I do. Uh, especially when Jote fell off. Jote was my original inspiration, but then he uh, decided to leave Jote and Jorel Morel. Uh, so Primal Rights kind of filled his spot, and now he's gone. So um, really sad, but this is the least I can do. Euphoria. Um, Stargate was a yeah really good um, intro. Really good intro. So super excited. Oh my gosh, this is the first time I've really connected with his music. A lot of his music is too weird for me, but this is great. I kind of wish it was a bit more colorful. Um, I, I guess the, the vibe that I'm getting from the color art, the color art, the cover art, and uh the name and stuff like that i kind of wish it was more colorful very similar to euphoria from cloudy um but of course i can't compare that like that i still think this is really good um not a hundred percent on the idea quite yet though in terms of execution i think it's perfect like i think the execution is really good and i know i also know what he likes and what he don't doesn't like because um i've listened to a lot of his or watched a lot of his reactions I'm just not completely sold on the idea quite yet, but I will save it because that's really good. So, uh, let's move on to Gleam. Uh, this EP is a blend of his heavy and melodic stuff. Primal sub movement is crazy. Yeah, but that song, there was some sub that was too low. But this sub movement is great. Loving this so far. Love that, love that. I don't have any complaints, and I think the idea is phenomenal. I really hope. No way, no way, dude. Lo-fi rhythm? Lo-fi... <gasps> No shot losing sacks. No way. That's the rest of the song, too. Bro, it's shy is like I told you. <laughs> w Primal Rise, welcome back, Moon. Kenny G would be impressed. <laughs> no, dude. Oh. 
switch up is dope. The jazz section, the percussion also is fantastic on that. Like what? Best one yet. I, I don't have anything to say. Let's move on. Serenity. Serenity now. <laughs> Piano keys, dude. Um, lots of color stuff on the top and a flute. Uh, 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 no, I'm not ready. Not ready. Not ready. Going back. it is the rest of it is great i love the idea um, most of the execution i guess it, it is where i think i'm lacking in because like i'm fine with that sound but it's just too much for what the idea is i think um the flute dude and the, the keys like dude you're you're laying down like really really light airy keys but then you just have a crunchy bass i don't i don't think those go well like I would reduce that part at least, uh, the, the bass type thing, but the atmosphere that is being built here is still great. Like, that's too much, I think. But I like it just too much. Lo-fi rhythm stuff, I mean, this is still phenomenal. I've Lo-fi rhythm, I've never heard of that, but it's amazing. Splitter situation, uh, where it's too much, but in a good way. Yeah, it, it kind of is a, a splitter situation. I don't think nearly as bad as, like, Wait For Me, although I still like that song. <laughs> Uh, all right, this is Samsara. This is the best Primal Rights music project I've heard. Because a lot of his stuff I haven't been able to connect with because it's a too weird and quirky, but this is the best that I've been able to hear from him. I love the cover art, too. The cover art's freaking amazing. It's kind of weird, but also that's his style, not mine. So I guess I can respect it. Uh, this one is just so different than the others that I kind of can't compare them. I think I like the others better, um, just by personal preference, but this is still fantastic. Definitely a vibe, yeah. They're all a vibe. Gleam, Serenity, Gleam is the biggest vibe for me meaning it's my favorite but this one is also fantastic so <sighs> yeah this is a reaction not necessarily a review imperfections primal sang on this song i'm cool with that sounded great if that's the case Like, this is just... What? <laughs> the atmosphere throughout this entire EP is amazing. Specifically this last song.
that is the best way to end an EP I've ever heard. And two, I think it's safe to say that's the best Silken Wood project I've heard in 2023. Yeah, Primal, you outdid yourself on this. This is unbelievable. Um, first time I've really connected with your music as well. Unbelievable. Um, this this is a um, this is a nine and a half out of ten for me. This is amazing. Thank you so much for watching the entirety of this video. It really does mean a lot and it helps me out a ton. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like the video down below and subscribe as it helps me out a lot. And if you want, join the Discord, which will be in the description. Thank you, and I'll see you in the next one.